There are times when you may want to work with Microsoft Office files in Google Drive so that you can collaborate or share or work together. Um, if you are in the old drive, and you'll notice that it's still the old drive because it says create over here instead of new. Um, if you go into your settings, there is a set called upload settings, and you can make sure that it confirms settings before each upload. So if that check mark is not there, all you have to do is go in and check on that and it will show that your upload settings are going to confirm. Then what you need to do is go over to the arrow and on the arrow is where you upload. So when you click on upload you can tell it you want to upload a file. If you click on the file it will then come over here and say what file do you want to upload so I will notice that I have an AA sample upload uh, word file on my desktop I'm gonna click on that and say open at that point it gives me a, a warning or a message that says what do you want to do and I can check the box that tells it to convert I can set that so that it always does that but I like to always double check when I start the upload, I'm going to get a message over here on the right that says you're dealing with this file. It will tell me that it's converted. And then if I go to my list in my drive, I can see that that document is there. I can tell it's in Google format because the icon in front of it is a Google icon. Um, if I open that document, it opens up just like any Google document. I can now go up in the right hand corner and I can share. I can do anything I need to with that Google Doc. When I'm finished with that Google Doc, if I need to get it back out into a format that is Word format so I can send it to someone else, I can file download as and I can download it as a Word document into my downloads folder um, and send it off to who needs to have the finished product.